Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Kate area and down to the bottom left hand corner of the map. We have our red Zerg player from Team SCV Life up 3-2 in this set. It is Hyun and his opponent, who is not really pulling yet, up here at the top left hand corner, our purple Zerg player from Startail, the one and only Life. Now let's hope that Life doesn't break the pattern via a loss here. It has always been, we were talking about it earlier. Hyun wins, then Life wins. Yeah. Um, and, you know, Life did get to choose this map. Um, and in this situation, <laughs> well. And he's going to 10 pool. Um, that's good. This is we our latest pool that we've had in any of our six games so far was 12. So, wow. We're back to this. <laughs> uh, I mean, it's not it's not so surprising. It looks like no. uh, extractor trick for drone. Not going to cancel it. Um, so it is going to be uh, really, really invested all in here. Right. And that actually makes a little more sense because if you're going to go for the 10 pool on a four player map and you're just trying to like get Zerglings into your opponent's base fast to do quick damage, mm -hmm. presents a little bit, a bit of a problem because, you know, it's a four player map and spawns are not predetermined. Uh, this is obviously not cross only. So, uh, and well, looking at these positions actually, um, a little bit advantageous towards. Um, Life, I believe it is. I'm looking Let's see. where the destructible debris are. Because, like, okay, so this is life's natural. It pops out here off to the right a little bit. And then you have the, uh, that's actually an open base there off to the side. And the destructible rocks are actually. Oh, you know what? I uh, am familiar with a different version. Obviously, obviously ah, excuse okay. me, this is the IPL. Um, was uh, ESV version, I believe, is okay. what I was looking at from earlier. Gotcha. So. Um, either way, guys, Life is now moving out with his first initial group of links. Now, he obviously, you know, we were talking about how this isn't like mm -hmm. uh, the 10 pool complete early all in. Uh, it's going to rely a little bit more on that later. And he's actually only going for speed here. Yeah, he may. Now, Life can pull out every once in a while a one base uh, speed link all in. And he does do that from time to time. We may see a bailing nest put up here in a bit, too. Um, I'm not saying that is going to be the case here, but it could be. And Hyun finds this out with the drone and is thinking, oh, are you joking? we got to do this again. Um, doing a nice job of leading those circlings yeah. away for a little bit longer, though, so we can get a few up of his own. It, yeah, that, that was actually really, really nice out of Hyun, buying himself an extra couple seconds here. And that can make all the difference when it comes to whether you lose a hatch, whether you don't. Trying to do what he can, but he's only got six circlings right now, trying to pick off that drone. No, and he can't do it. Hyun actually going to escape with it for the time being and generates a little more uh, hit points on his initial hatchery. This is really good, actually, for Hyun. I mean, he's bought so much time, he hasn't lost a single unit now, and not a lot of damage has been done. All right. Well, um, it's kind of what I thought, though. We yep. do have a massive, massive, massive circling push coming out of life here in a second, so he is not content with the amount of damage he's done. And uh, we'll see if he adds on bailings or if it's going to be nothing but just speedling all in. Speed is about to complete here. Speed is still very far away from Hyun. But the big kicker is that Hyun has not thrown down a single spine crawler. Spine crawler is so vital to holding this push off. Uh, we actually saw a game, uh, I, I was, oh, it was so recent too, but it was uh, two spine crawlers couldn't hold this off on this exact same map. Um, so life, here we go. Ling's getting a nice surround here with speed. There are a lot of Zerglings for Hyun. He's gonna do everything he can, but here come the reinforcements, and there are a lot of them. Life overwhelming Hyun's uh, speedless links. Wow. Kills the queen, gets onto the ramp, gonna surround this queen as well, and catastrophic amounts of damage dealt to TSL Hyun. Oh yeah, he's got 14 links coming up at the same time now, but he's already done the, the damage that he was looking for with more links starting to pour in. We'll see if he can continue to put on the pressure. How many links are up for Hyun in total? Just 12 to his opponent's 20. That number is actually slowly falling. So uh, this is very, very rough for uh, Hyun at the moment. Life actually really making this work and just continuing to power ahead. Yeah, you know, now he's got the queen. His opponent does not. He's getting Larva Injects back at home. And oh. speed is, while it's about to, com uh, to complete here, the production of life is just going to be so very quick. And it's all from one base, remember, while Hyun just keeps catching these links over. In fact, you know what? That's, that last set of links might have been it. Yeah, I mean, this is looking very, very bleak for Hyun. He's actually losing a couple more drones. Now he's down to just 14 supply. And we may have an early pull that truly, truly works now uh, as more links continue to stream in. And it looks like life is going to clean up the last couple of units. Eight supply to 21. And uh, even though Hyun has a few workers up, he is now at a critical disadvantage. There's GG. 
Life has tied it up. He has also tied the maximum amount of wins that any other player has had against Hyun in Fight Club history. This is a really exciting set. I mean, it's been so back and forth. Now, who can you give the match to? I really don't know at this point. We're tied up once again now, Kevin. And we're going to move to Antigua Shipyard as our next map. We're going to take a very quick commercial break, and when we come back, it'll be time for game number seven.